What's up? This is EasyOSX, and today I'm going to show you how to redact text in a PDF document using Preview. To do this, you're going to need at least macOS 11, Big Sur, or newer. That's when they introduced this feature. Now, there's the understandable but mistaken idea that redacting text means that you just have to cover it up with a colored box and your text is done away with. That may work in physical documents, but not digital documents. Let me demonstrate that here. I've got this old NSA document from their public archive, and I'll have the link to it in the description. And I'll be covering over Winston Churchill's name here. As you can see, when you do that in Big Sur, you'll get a warning box that basically says the text isn't actually removed from the document. Case in point, if I highlight this phrase around and including the text I covered over, and put it into this text editor, you can see that the phrase contains the text I covered over. And you can find news articles where this has bitten people in the butt. Even if you're not involved in a political scandal, there may be times where you need to redact text before sending it over the web as an additional layer of privacy or security. In preview, starting in Big Sur, you can now use the redact feature either by going to tools in the menu bar and hitting redact or by hitting the markup button in the toolbar and then hitting the redact button. Typically, third from the left and looks like a square with a solid outline and interior. You'll get a warning that once you close the document, the text underneath will be deleted and won't be recoverable. So make sure you double check yourself before you think you're done. Now you'll notice the button has lit up, in this case to a teal color. And when I highlight the text, it's instead drawing black squares with white X's through them. While I'm still in editing mode, I can hover over the text to see what the text actually says. And if I make a mistake, I can hit the undo button, either in the edit menu of the menu bar, or by hitting command Z on the keyboard. If you want to get out of redaction mode, hit another button in the markup toolbar, such as the text highlight button. In this state, the text is still highlightable. Remember, it's only when you close or duplicate the document that the text will actually be removed. So I'm going to duplicate this as a new file to show you. And name this the redacted copy. Now, when I highlight that same phrase and copy it into the text editor, you can see that Winston Churchill's name is not present in the copied text. So if you've got any text you need removed before you digitally send a document and you've got a Mac running Big Sur or newer, now you know how to properly redact it. Thank you all so much for watching. If this video helped you out, then give it a like. It'll really help the channel out. Likewise, if you want more Mac, iOS, and other Apple tips, tricks, and advice, you can subscribe to the channel. You can also check us out on the website easyosx.net as well as on our social media pages. Thank you all so much for watching and we'll catch you next time.